2PMS Jun Ho has been enjoying his recent second wave of popularity, as the idol turned actor relishes in his newfound success. And just like any other successful star, reporters have sought to dig up dirt on the actor, but they were met with extreme failure due to Jun Ho's deeply rooted kind nature. Korean entertainment reporter Lee Jin Ho of DMU 9 TA Umlaut 8 recently uploaded a YouTube video explaining just how kind the 2PM member with a variety of stories. The reporter kickstarted his video by revealing he had contacted reporter Lee Hai Na with the Daily Sports to hear more about her experiences with Jun Ho. Upon his investigation, it was unanimously concluded that the actor was truly a wonderful human being. He started off the interview with Lee Hai Na by revealing he had read her interview regarding Jun Ho and the 80 handwritten letters he wrote for reporters. He asked the Daily Sports reporter for more details regarding the letters. Lee Jin Ho, I saw your article about Lee Jun Ho's 80 handwritten letters that he wrote personally for the reporters. Could you explain how that came to be? Lee Hai Na, sure thing. Lee Jun Ho's shy has been experiencing a lot of popularity with his recent drama appearances. Due to this, there have been a lot of positive articles about him. In addition to that, many reporters have reached out to him with requests to do individual interviews with him. Dot Lee Hai Na from the Daily Sports continued with her story by sharing why she believed Jun Ho personally wrote letters for each reporter. From Lee Jun Ho's perspective, he was grateful that these reporters would share their precious time with him. He believed that the positive articles about him had a good influence on his drama's viewership ratings as well. I think because of these factors, he wrote the letters out of a grateful heart and also as a New Year's greeting. The Daily Sports Reporter Lee Hai Na. The Daily Sports Reporter further shared details from her personal experience working with and interviewing Jun Ho. Lee Hai Na revealed that for her particular interview, she turned on her camera and concluded a virtual face to face meeting due to her seniority and previous experience working with the 2 pm member. She shared this particular detail because according to the reporter, many others would only conduct the interview with audio and no video feature. On a photo card of himself, he wrote each individual reporter's name along with his signature. He also remembered a personal characteristic of each reporter and included it into his letter with his team. For mine, he wrote, thank you for sharing your precious time with me. I received a lot of strength from you and our face-to-face -face interview. Thank you for showing me your face. Lee Hai Na.The reporter shared even more amazing details about the idol turned actor, including his strong identity as a 2PM member, despite his popularity and other idol turned actors' attempts to hide their idol identity. Lee Jin Ho. Usually with idol turned actors, they try to hide their idol identity, but with Lee Jun Ho, he repeatedly introduced himself as 2PMS Lee Jun Ho, and he received a lot of attention for it. Dot Lee Hai Na, yeah he did. It seems like he really didn't want to lose his identity. 2PM is still an existing group, and he's still a member of the group. In addition to that, Lee Jun Ho earned the title My House Jun Ho during his promotions with 2PM, and became an icon of sudden viral success. Because of all this, I think he has a special connection to his identity as a 2PM member.